I gotta show you guys something really cool. <laughs> There's pretty few universals out there, but I think one of them is that receiving a gift package in the mail is um, is a really nice feeling. And I got this package in the mail today. <laughs> it comes from a William Davis of Deetsville, Alabama, and he works with uh, timber rattler snakes there and, and other uh, venomous snakes, I'm sure. Down in the deep south, they got, you know, several different uh, species. Any case, like many others, uh, watching my YouTube channel, he's noted that after I started using the, the bucket cam this summer, um, you can really see how agitated it makes the snakes to be in the bucket when you when you spin the lid on the bucket and things you know they're just dealing with shadows and movement and such um, it's very highly stressful for them and he said he's developed a, a box that he uses and he uses it for larger snakes in particular and they seem to be much more calm in the box and so very generously he took it upon himself to make me one of his boxes and he paid like 84 bucks American to send this to me. Uh, this is a good guy. So, I'm going to show you this box. It's, it's very cool. Comes with some keys and a note which we'll read in a heartbeat here, but okay, so it's got a locking mechanism on the front and the box opens on hinges. It's really nicely made and uh, painted dark. He's got some burlap in here so that things are soft, comfortable for the snakes. Little uh, cage on the top here so that, um, you know, there's light and such moving through and a handle. And this little thing, a PVC pipe opening, um, I imagine so that you can just let the snakes crawl out on their own, right? So this is very cool, very cool. Let me give you a close-up look of it too. Hey. nice. So, the keys and a note. He says, uh, Ryan, hope you get as much use out of this box as I do mine. By all means, develop your own guidelines for using it. But I only use the box for bigger snakes. The smaller ones, I use buckets as not to pinch one with the lid. The lid is designed to be forced down when closing. That way it stays closed during the release until you press down on it with your hook. The PVC tube is very helpful to me on snakes with an attitude or one that is injured that I don't want to lift. That's good. That's a good thing. Um, just unscrew the cup and once it sees the hole it normally will go right in. Stand the box on its side so the cap is on the top before you secure it. Um, also, I do not release out of the tube they don't want to come out <laughs> yeah that makes sense it's nice and dark in there and everything they don't want to come out uh, and they can strike out of it so as you'll see the snakes seem to like the box they feel safe in it uh, with the screen it can better monitor it hope you like it and it works for you so that's really cool of course I'll probably mount a camera in there bucket cam hey so we can uh, have a look at the snakes and I'm hoping that we'll be able to test run this baby even as early as tonight but almost surely uh, for tomorrow. I have had two snake calls already today and we're, we're in for a warm week. Um, the first call that I had today I wasn't able to attend myself so I asked Sherry Merchant to, to go and grab it for me. Um, it was at the Lethbridge uh, Country Club and so she sent me a couple little clips of her 
of her uh, technique for release, and I'll, I'll share those with you. And then the second snake that I got today, uh, or the call at least, was in Paradise Canyon. There was a there was a small rattlesnake moving through uh, some of the yards um, on Canyon Boulevard, but it got out into the coulee before I could even get there. So it, it released itself and um, and uh, in good order. So yeah, I know the stragglers the stragglers right now are going to be making their way back to the dens this week. I expect to get more calls. And we're going to give this baby a test run. Um, William, what can I even say, man? This is uh, quite a generous gesture that you've done. And uh, thank you very much. And I look forward to using this box in the future snake videos. Watch for them.